Hello my YouTube friends, I'm here with a haul video. If you hear any hammering or anything like that, that's my uh, husband hammering away in here inside the house. I'm sorry, you know, saying sorry in advance. I had gotten a, I went to the Goodwill thrift store and the first thing that I saw when I looked at this big bag of stuffed animals or flesh was this Lovey's Carter Unicorn security blanket for babies and I thought you know might as well start investing in buying plush to sell uh, I, I rarely dabble in stuffed animals because I don't know a thing about them. I got, oh, how cute. Look at this dog here. It's furry with the pink long ears. I think this is cute. Doesn't have a label, but I can take a picture of it and upload it to Google then and see, you know. For the levies, I'll probably list it for twelve ninety one somewhere around there. I'm not sure yet. Look at this, how cute! It's got her. She's got her pink skirt. Um, this one here is. Um, let's see, baby starters, all new materials, twenty eighteen. Rash T and Rash T. It has a style number. I have it here in this tag. I can look up the style or I can Google Lens it and see what pops up. She's got her shoes. Real cute doll. She's got her bows and everything. That is so cute. Oh, how cute. Look. That's called uh, Disney Raya, The Last Dragon. Disney Raya and The Last Dragon Suspect is what his name is. It's got the tag, it's got the barcode so I can scan it and see how much he's going for. I like his little fingers and nails, I'm not sure. Very cute. And it's got this little trim right here. Oh, cute. The next one is, I think this is Paw Patrol. Uh, the tag is taken off. I can go ahead and Google Lens it. It's in good shape. And I could also wash it. I'm sure it won't hurt if I put it in the wash. The next thing is a bunny rabbit for Easter. Um, this does not have the brand tag or the material. This is purple, my purple. This one is a lion. It says, I love you. This one will be great for Valentine's Day. This one does not have a brand or anything, but like I said, I can put it on. I can upload it to Google Lens. Um, freeze me. Cadbury doesn't work. But this one is gallery, candy and gifts. This is just a bunny rabbit with the ribbon and it says Cadbury all around it. Really cute. The next one is a little doll. Disney. Surface washable only air dry. I have no idea who she is. She's got a long material tag and she has like a purple dress. She's got her Hair braided and 
The next one is pink. I think that says Trolls DreamWorks 2020. Just a girl troll with her fake ice cream or microphone. I'm not sure. With the glitter, glitter in her hair. This is the back, and then she's got the psychedelic dress on. So I'm thinking she's a singer. The next one is a bumblebee. Look at the ears, real floppy ears. This is a new material made in China, 100% polyester fiber. The next one is Aurora. I do have to wash all these stuffed animals. This is January 2019, it does have stains, so I'll have to wash it. And this one is a Barbie doll. I don't know what character she is or anything like that. Her hair is all messy. I have to wash her hair, wash the, her dress, and... She did not come with high heels or anything like that. The dress is removable. Trying to see. It just says CE. So I'll have to do some research on that. The next one is a rainbow plush elephant TY. This one is Elfie, is what it's called, Elfie, because the eyes, the blue and black eyes. The next one is a bird. I have no idea. Does not have a material tag or a brand tag or anything like that. Next one's a fish. This one is says W on it, Gans. I've heard Gans can do great on the reseller market. Little King's Polka Back Fish is what it's called. Um, this is product made in China. I don't know when it was made. I have to do some research. There's a Gans tag there. It is hot here in Texas now. I have no idea about this one. I don't know how to about Moose. This one is by Disney and uh, I have no idea, but I'll have to Google answers as well. Next one is a zebra, zebra, or a giraffe, I'm not sure. Um, brand new with tags, this is Republic Rescue by Wild something. Join the Republic Rescue. This is why Republic. Uh, 19, 1955, May 25th. Okay, that's just the address. I was trying to see if it had a year on it. KM International Incorporated. I'll have to scan the barcode and see what it tells me if that comes up or not oh how cute look how cute how cute is this no brand name nothing real cute rainbow blush oh it makes noise 
cartoons or anything like that. She does have her shoes and she's got her dress. This one's a dog. It's Yoni by Aurora. So I do have to clean her up. She does have the tag here. Um, so I have to do some research. Okay, and then the monkey with the heart. That'll be great for Valentine's Day. Um, spot clean. Tom's Toy International, Hong Kong, made in China. So I have plush and I also have what I got at the thrift store. This came in a bag. This was around, it says $14.99, but the yellow tags were half off, so I probably paid around $7. 99. This is Coco by Fwish. Look how pretty this unicorn is. I love it. Next one's a fish as well. I think it's Nemo. No, Dory. Van Dye. Dory. 2016. This is this story. And then a puppy with the Valentine's heart. Great for Valentine's Day. I will have to hurry up and uh, after I clean them up and everything, start taking pictures and posting them. This one is Korean material. I have no idea. I have no idea. This is a cute uh, it's not a stuffed animal, but it's just a toy. But look at how cute she is. No idea who she is. She does have like a marking there, so I'll have to get my magnifying glass and see what that is. This one is a cute little plush. These are like plastic legs, arms, and face. If you know what any of the characters are that I'm showing you, please let me know. I think that one's cute. This one's a TY, the teeny beeny booze. This is Seymour, 2017. Very cute little plush there. Um, Who she is. She's a cute Barbie doll. I don't know if she's supposed to have another wing. It's just, it just has one. 
a little guy. I don't know where he's from, what character he plays, what movie. This is by Nobi. I think this is just for babies, like a TV ring maybe, I don't know, or to play with. The TV ring. This is by Bright Start. Bright Start. This one's a little like a game or phone or something. I have to put batteries to see if it works. The next one is a bunny. Great for Easter time. It does have a label there. It's called Bunnies by the Bay. I have to wash it. It's very soft for a towel to play with. This one's by Paw Patrol as well. I can probably lot those together. Or other dog. This one, just lock them together and sell them. Hmm. This one is Bright Starts again for babies to play with, like a giraffe. I don't know what it has inside it. Some more, like some keys and stuff. I have no idea what this goes to. I think it's supposed to light up, make noise. Like if you're riding a driving a car, which that is neat. I've never seen anything like that. Another, well, this is Paw Patrol as well. Got a name of somebody. Um, T-Y, it says Marshall, I think it goes with the other ones. Okay, another bunny, I can probably lot them or sell them individually. Oh, how cute. <laughs> this one is T-Y, Thai Silk. Shell 100% Thai silk. Glit glitzy is what it's called. Real cute. I got some good stuff in here. This is by CPK. This also has the hoodie with the ears. Doesn't want to stay on. Has a big head. It's got some markings right there. A baby. I think this is for Easter. It does have like uh, some tears and stuff like that. CPK. Um, I don't know about selling this one. Oh, my baby goes. And then this right here, I have no idea. I think you just hang it on something. I have no idea. And we have this monkey. It's knitted. Um, real cute. I can probably sell this one as well. And then a little doll. This is for, looks like a China, like a Chinese little girl or Eskimo, Disney. H3 plus, okay, air dry. She's got her little dress, she's got her little ribbon, 
belt and then a hat. Real cute and it's like a belt. The dolls that we used to have back in the day. And a little elephant. So cute. It's got the star tail there. And that separately. It's just little toys. I'm not sure what that is. It's just little like a teasing ring. And then a rainbow something. Real cute. I can probably sell this with the other one. Like it. And then this right here is um, it's a dog, I think. Yeah, for the pink nose. XO. So I'm going to put all of these back in here. I still have to wash them. I still have to sanitize these. So I'm going to have a lot of work ahead of me. All the Valentine stuff, I'm going to have to wash them and start listing those immediately. And then I'll be back with the haul from the, the same thrift store, but it's not going to be plush. It's going to be like shoes and clothes and things like that. I have gotten some stuff for myself too sheets and a table liner for my kitchen table. Okay. okay. I like to stay organized. I don't like everything here and there in, in this room. And I'm gonna complete this one. I have to wash them, like I said. I got these cups here. These are black. These are a 4M6W, whatever that means. These are the Dual Crocs Comfort. Never sold Crocs before. Well, I have. Uh, I have no idea what to price these for. I'll have to do some research. This is Ralph Lauren, the Blue Tag 16 Large Classic Fit. The purple tags were 25% off. This is striped button up for guys or men. It's got the logo there. No idea what to price those for. I wanted to get some men's items because I love picking up men's clothing items. This is a yellow tag half off. This was $5.99. I probably paid around $2.99 or something like that. This is St. John's Bay. Quality menswear, extra large, gentlemen's, gentlemen's, something essentials. So it's just this nice red and white print button up. It's got the pleating in the back. It's got a pocket front. This one's an extra large. I have no idea what to price these for. I just got them because they're nice. I like the style of them. And whatever I bought myself, I will not be showing. Then I got these capris. They're black. 
I got them because they have pockets and it's called Boston Proper. I've never found this Boston Proper uh, anywhere. These are a nylon and spandex, 5% spandex. Um, these are a size medium. They are my size medium, but I don't think they're medium petite. I am petite, so I just thought they were a nice capri pants to work or to go out on a revamp. Oh, here's a purple tie. It's $5.99, which I paid uh, 25% off of that. This is a yellow tie, $4.99. Uh, half off Emma and James dresses it says but these are pants they're a size 8 and they do have a zippered back and then they don't have pockets but they are more shiny they're thin it's a thin material I just like these kind of pants, you know, somebody can wear for work or to an event of some type. Oh, these are wearing shoes and clothing. These are $5.99 purple tag. These are arts and these are Leather upper. These are a 11 medium. They're not suede. Or faux suede, I'm not sure. Never picked um, these type of shoes before. Never picked those up. This says Clark's on the bottom. And yeah, real nice shoes. They're not worn at all. Look at the outer sole or the bottom sole. Real nice shoes as well. I love those shoes. And then then these I found. I didn't know that they were coach. These are ankle zip. Boots with a heel on those. They're in very nice condition. These are size 7B. And it does have a coach, like the stage coach there. It's got the, uh, what do you call these? Grommets? Or I'm not sure. No, they're not grommets. They're, um, I forgot. Anyway, nice women's shoes or coach. So yeah, nice find there. <laughs> then blue and gray leggings. They're size medium and. They're just these gray leggings. They're not joggers or anything like that. I just picked them up because they're a nice gray color. These are rayon, polyester, and 5% spandex. These are cute. I like these. And they have some time and true flip flops or slides. These are 11W. These are $5.99. Um, the green was 75% off. 
and I should have bought more of these, but I just got one just to see how well they do. Um, they look to be in brand new condition. There was a whole bunch of other colored um, slides like this, and these are heavy, and they do have the buckle uh, straps, so let's see how well those will do. And then I got these, they're real nice, I have no idea the brand, but everything on here is leather. Upper leather, lining leather. It says Alco Synthetic. So uh, these are a nine and a half blue tag, two ninety nine, which I didn't mind paying full price for these at the Goodwill thrift store. They're in real good condition. Great for spring and summer. This baby blanket and it has a giraffe and it has the turtle leaves just like that on one side. I have no idea. It says little beginners 100% polyester. So this is for little beginners, which is the babies, I believe. So and it's just a white fleece blanket. This shirt for men. This is Mark Echo Cut and Sew. Deadly Thread. 72nd Division. Size large for men. 100% cotton. Short sleeve. And then it has the Pocket on the sleeve, pocket right there, and then it has this right here. This one says Mark Echo Cut and So, 72nd Division, organized since 1972, New York City. You know that this was made, this is vintage. Look at the stitching. Like it has double stitch, but. I mean, it's nice. I like it. Yeah. Turn garment inside out. Real nice. I'm going to see if my husband wants it. It's a size medium. He wears a medium. He likes pockets on his shirts. So, I'm going to see if he wants that. one I'm going to show is, are these sandals. These are by Cliff by White Mountain. I've never heard of these before. These are all man-made material, six and a half medium. I don't know if I'm going to keep them because I do wear a six and a half. These were $3.99. Half off of this would be $1.99. And, uh, yeah, these are called the Zazu. And I did get me some more shoes for myself. I got the Kleenex unopened. So, yeah, that is my haul. Let me know if you like the haul. Let me know if you like the haul by giving me a like. Subscribe to my channel so you'll see the what sold videos and haul videos and, you know, things like that. You never know when I'll be back on again. So, thank you for watching. Bye.